In this demo, we will be highlighting the Payroll Conversion Wizard. After upgrading to the new payroll, you will need to convert your payroll data. Companies that include payroll will need to be converted individually. In Company Maintenance, if you choose the option to convert data for all companies, a message will display if one or more of your companies includes payroll. If you select Continue, all companies that do not include payroll will be converted. You can then return to Company Maintenance and convert each payroll company individually. Once you select the company, the Payroll Conversion Wizard will automatically open and guide you through the steps necessary to convert your data. If at any time you cancel out of the wizard, the information you entered will be saved and will not need to be re-entered when you restart the conversion. Clicking this link will give you information on converting your payroll data. In the new payroll, department numbers can only contain alphanumeric characters. If you use payroll departments and a department number contains special characters, for example a dollar sign or an asterisk, you will need to replace the original department with a new one. It is important that you enter a new department number and not one that already exists. This page will only display if a department number contains special characters. Payroll now uses tax groups for calculating federal, state, and local taxes. The wizard will automatically map a tax group to each state tax code. If you are using local tax codes, each state and local tax code combination must be mapped to one tax group. It is important that you review all records to ensure that the correct tax groups have been mapped. To make a change, simply click the lookup and select the tax group from the Payroll Tax Database. You must map all records before advancing to the next page in the wizard. On this page, you will need to map a tax profile to each tax group. The first step is to create your profiles using Tax Profile Maintenance. This program allows you to create profiles that are then assigned to employees in employee maintenance and are used to calculate employee taxes in payroll data entry. You must have rights set up in Role Maintenance to access this program. For more information on creating profiles, please refer to the video for Tax Profile Maintenance. I have already created a tax profile for California and Wisconsin. Now I will map them to the corresponding tax group. Tax profiles are not company specific, so once you create a profile, it will be available to be mapped in the next payroll company you convert. The wizard will attempt to map an existing tax profile to a tax group but it is important that you review all mappings to ensure they are correct. You must map all records before advancing to the next page in the wizard. The filing statuses in the payroll tax database may differ from the ones that you are using. The wizard will attempt to automatically map them, but you may need to enter a filing status for certain state and local tax code combinations. Some states only have a single filing status for all residents. In previous versions, those states were assigned a filing status of all. In the new payroll, these filing statuses will no longer be used and will be marked as not required. It is important that you review all records to ensure that the correct filing statuses have been mapped. To make a change, simply click the lookup and select the filing status from the list available. The list will be filtered by state, so only the matching filing statuses for the tax group will appear. 
You must map all records before advancing to the next page in the wizard. This is the final page of the wizard. You can review your selections by printing the wizard listing or viewing them in the list box. When you click Finish, your payroll data will be converted and a conversion log will be created. Click Activity Log to locate and view the log file for the company you just converted. This concludes the demo for the Payroll Conversion Wizard. Thank you for watching.